What does HIV rash look like? HIV rash on the chest. Hello folks it's Mark Medicals with the latest news on HIV cure, HIV treatment, HIV symptoms, and HIV testing. This video covers the following topics. 1. What does HIV rash look like on black skin? 2. How do you know if your rash is HIV? 3. Does HIV cause chest rash? 4. Is HIV rash itchy or not? 5. How long do HIV rashes last? 6. Can rash be the only symptom of HIV? Alright, here we go. Question, what does HIV rash look like on black skin? Any skin rash appears differently on different skin colors. The rash on the white body appears differently compared to dark or red skin. If you have black skin, a rash brought on by a fresh HIV infection typically appears on your face or body and is characterized by tiny pimples. On black skin, the region could seem purple. The color is typically crimson on white skin. What I need to remind you is that early HIV rash is no different from other rashes from different diseases. Having a skin rash does not directly imply you have HIV. There are so many causes of body rash apart from HIV and these include some medications, allergies, liver diseases, and others. But an HIV rash within two to four weeks after exposure is a wake-up call you could have been infected. This early rash is usually due to your body reacting to the new virus. Question, how do you know if your rash is HIV? You cannot tell if your rash is due to early HIV infection or not because even HIV negative people suffer from the rash. But if you tested HIV positive and then you develop a body rash, no doubt that is an HIV related rash. Of course, it is not easy to detect early HIV especially if you are living in countries where there are no advanced tests. Early HIV can only be detected with good testing kits like 4th generation or HIV RNA kits. I already have many videos explaining HIV testing. Check out those videos on this channel. Question, does HIV cause chest rash? Although it can appear anywhere on the body, the face, chest, and occasionally the hands and feet are the areas where it most frequently manifests. It might also result in mouth sores. Only a history of risky exposure should make you suspicious of an early HIV infection. If you are living with AIDS, chances are that most likely your body rash is due to weakened immunity. HIV destroys your CD4 cells making your body attackable by many infections. Normal people usually have 600 to 1500 CD4 cells that give the body protection against infections. People living with HIV usually have few CD4 cells as compared to normal people. Question, is HIV rash itchy or not? People with the infection get inflamed skin, which is known as an HIV rash. It might itch, turn red or purple, or hurt. Most HIV-positive individuals get a rash at some point. It's a typical sign of HIV infection that might appear in the early, acute, or late stages. If you are living with AIDS and are taking your antiretroviral medications, your skin itch could be caused by the medications themselves or other AIDS-related infections like Prurigo. Prurigo is a sign of weakened immunity. Question, how long do HIV rashes last? Of course, people are different and also behave differently if we are attacked by diseases. For instance, some people live longer lives with HIV while others live shorter lifespans after infection. The average lifespan with untreated HIV is 5 to 15 years, while you will never die of HIV if you are taking your HIV medicines as told by the doctor. An HIV rash normally emerges during the acute stage of infection, which can last 2 to 4 weeks after getting HIV according to the US Department of Health and Human Services. As the body tries to combat the infection, the rash may persist for one to two weeks. The rash frequently looks like a red region of skin covered with small pimples. Can rash be the only symptom of HIV? Of course not. There are many infections that manifest soon after HIV infection and these include headache, 
fever, body rash, enlarged lymph nodes, fatigue, night sweats, diarrhea, and many others. It is not a guarantee that everyone suffers from the same early HIV symptoms. Studies have shown that only about 60% of people suffer from one or several early HIV symptoms. In some people, the only eye-opener symptoms will be the late state when they already have AIDS. We do not want you to develop AIDS because your body immunity may never fully recover as before. This is a reason you should get HIV treatment even if you got infected yesterday. Delaying for so long results in many HIV reservoirs in your body. From my past videos, you know this hidden HIV in reservoirs cannot be eliminated a reason HIV is incurable today. Your antiretroviral drugs have no effect on this hidden HIV a reason we do not need you to form many pockets of hidden HIV. If you are troubled by any HIV-related body rashes, check out our recommended health products in the description section below this video.